Hey guys, this is the fire the new or keep saying that fireplace and today I'm gonna be showing you how to download Minecraft Bedrock on a Mac. So the first thing you'll need to do is go to mcplauncher.readthedocs.io slash en slash latest slash index dot html. The reason I just read that out to you instead of put that in the description is because I'm lazy to put things in the description. So just just pause the video, copy this. Okay. So once you go there, search it, and then what you need to do underneath contents, it says getting started. Click that. Then what you'll need to do is click a pre-built Mac OS binary is available here. Click available here. It downloads. And once you do that, you download it. And you just drag it into the applications. You just open the DMG. And then you drag the Minecraft launcher into the applications, I think. And then once you do that, open it. And it'll come up with this. And then you go to settings. It'll say sign in right here. You want to click that. This is the most important thing. You need to have Minecraft um, bought and downloaded on a device that has the Google Play Store on it. Or you can just go to the Google Play Store on, like, Safari or Firefox or whatever. And then download it from there, which is what I did. And then, you want to click sign in. And then once you do that, go here, click the little down arrow. And then click add new profile. Name whatever you want. I'm just going to name it latest ver version. version. Latest version. Make sure it says latest version Google Play right there. You can change the window size if you want, but you don't have to. And then click save. And then once you do that, you go to mine. Bedrock. And then click play. And then it should download. Then it will show this. And then after you do this, it's super small. So you're going to want to click settings. Poop scrap. Make a video. Oh. I mean, lovely poop scrap. It's not poop, but you edit that out. Can you pause your video? Nope. No, you need to. No, I forgot. Okay. Okay. Maybe I can't really find it. And then you'll want to click video. And then down here it says GUI scale modifier. You want to drag that either up or down. Doesn't matter, but if you drag it up, it'll look super big. And if it's all the way down, it'll be just like this. Like if you put it in the middle, like it was, or for me, it'll just be like medium size. But I like the And you can edit all your settings and stuff. But before you, and then after you do that, you're going to want to, well, go to settings. Well, you want, don't get out of that. Then you click profile, and then go to sign in. It'll say sign in right here somewhere. And then sign in to your Microsoft account. And if you don't have a Microsoft account, then make one and then sign into that. And you can play single player worlds, realms, and servers. And
then the next video I'm going to upload will show you how to get custom capes on this. I will show you what it looks like. See what it looks like on my Bedrock Survival Let's Play World that you guys should go check out first episode. It's pretty short because I just wanted to show you guys, well, ask if you guys wanted me to do that. Like, series. And yeah, creeper really up right behind me. Yeah. Ah, the signs! This is the cape. It works perfectly. I will show you how to get this next video. So thank you guys so much for watching the fire within no fireplace. And I keep getting it mixed up. Thank you guys so much for watching Fireplace. Like, share, and remember, be loud and awesome and proud. See you guys later. Bye. Blap.